right, back at it with another mining video. Uh, we're going to be taking a look at Radiant on the RTX 4060. Uh, for the miner, we are using BZ Miner. And for the pool, we are using Wooly Pooly. And we are mining to an exchange, which I would not recommend doing, but we are mining to Trade Ogre. Um, <clears throat> as for the memory, all 40 series should be Micron, but I think because it's GDDR6 non X memory, which would explain why it's Hynix, but anyway, um, we are sitting at looks like 55 to 58 watts on the GPU. Uh, all together at the wall, I'm sitting at about 147 to 152 watts. So not including the GPU, it's about, mm, give or take, about 90 watts. Anywho, let us uh, get started. So the stock hash rate we should be sitting at, this is with monitors off and just afterburner and the miner up. We... Or rather, I was getting 671.28 mega hash to 671.60 mega hash at 105 to 106 watts on the software. At the wall, currently, I am getting 222 to 229 watts at the wall. This uh, should give us a efficiency of 6.37. Um, let's go ahead and take a look at the thermals. I won't be able to show the memory junction temperature, unfortunately, but uh, currently right now in my home, it's 75 Fahrenheit and 70 Fahrenheit outside. But uh, anyway, it looks to be GPU temperature is 60 to 61 Celsius with a hot spot of looks like 82 to 83 Celsius. And that's pretty much it for that. Um, I guess they didn't bother putting in uh, any readings for memory junction temperature since uh, the TDP for this card isn't very high. But anyway... Let me close this on out and get started with the actual overclocks. Um, so we're going to go into the batch file and edit the batch file. Paste in locking the memory at not 810, but 5001. Hit save. Go ahead and start up the miner again. And then we are going to go ahead and lock, uh, lock the core at, let's see here, where is it? 915 millivolts at 2430 megahertz. And then add 350 on the core. So this overclock should give us a hash rate of 696.70 or actually 696.66 to 696 blah, point 87 mega hash at 87 watts to about 88 watts on the software and then at the wall currently I am getting 190 to 192 watts at the wall. This uh, should give us an efficiency of 7.98 to 7.99, so about roughly an efficiency of 8. Um, let, let us go ahead and look back at the thermals again. So I'm getting, looks to be at about anywhere from 48 
to 53C for the regular temperature and 66 to 67C for the hot spot. And I can't give you the memory junction temperature, obviously, but there will be a link down in the description of the actual hash rate. This was tested for an hour so that it would run smooth. And obviously this is, it's without me recording and the monitor is turned off. But uh, that's the video. Thanks for watching.